If you're a man in the market for a new pair of eyeglasses, you are in exactly the right place. Stick around. I'm going to talk about all these, these glasses right here. Hello and welcome. I'm Eyeglass Tyler right now. Eyeglass Tyler. It's funny because usually I do a little bit when I'm talking my goggles or whatever, but eyeglasses, it's like what I do. That's what I talk about. I'm talking to you about our top picks for men's eyeglasses of 2022. It's early. We're getting a head start on it. These are our top seven frames. We're very, very excited about this year, getting the year kicked off right. Obviously, you can get all of these in prescription at SportRx. If at the end of this, you're ready to order, don't forget about SportRx and definitely don't forget about our CBITR guarantee because with that, you're never stuck with something you don't like or just doesn't work for you. You actually have as long as 45 days with them. Yes, even if you get them in prescription, we really just want you to be happy so we will take care of you no matter what that means on our end also if you get a little intimidated about buying prescription online we have opticians who are trained certified knowledgeable friendly who would love to help you get it right the first time so you can always reach out to us all right let's get into this first up is the oakley tie bar far from being a new style but has been a top seller really since the day it came out. An amazing frame, really, really cool for a frame you can dress up, you can dress down, looks great. It's unassuming, but still stylish. It's a really cool frame. Titanium, very lightweight, extremely durable, super comfortable. Even the temples are titanium. There's no grip in this. It's just all titanium down to the very temple tips where it gets a little bit thicker to give you a little more weight. Of course, with Oakley's three point fit system, you never have to worry about these coming off your face, but you do have some slight adjustable bits that you can make sure that they fit perfectly on you. The other thing you get with this is the latch system. If you're unfamiliar with that, you should be familiar with it. It's kind of cool. Little latch systems on the insides of the temple so you can clip it onto your shirt and it stays on your shirt. It doesn't fall off. Anytime if you are the type like me, you'll put them in your shirt and then you'll be wearing sunglasses. You reach down to grab something like one of your kids and they fall off or you're holding one of your kids and then they knock it off or they grab them. That's not going to happen with this clip system, this latch system. It's amazing. The other thing that is notable about this design is that it has what we call an inline groove design, where instead of the lenses being what we call a high to bevel, like a little V in the, the lens, and then it sits inside the material, there is actually a groove cut into the lens that means that the frame sits inside that groove. So instead of the lens sitting inside the frame, the frame sits inside the lens, and that's how the lens is secured into the frame. Why that's important is because if you have a stronger prescription, the lens thickness is going to be more noticeable something to be aware of. When it comes to sizes, this is available in two eye sizes, a 53 and a 55. And when it comes to SFW, that'll land you at a 133 and a 137 millimeter respectively. Next up, we have a newer edition from Costa. This is their Ocean Ridge 400. I'm really excited about this one. A little bit more of a bold design. It is a plastic frame, so if you are a fan of that rectangular shape of the tie bar, but you're looking for more of a non-metal frame, check out the Ocean Ridge 400. It's made out of a bioresin nylon material, which is very eco-friendly and resistant to high temperatures. So it's going to stick around for longer, even through some more heavy duty wear and tear, some beating them up. They incorporated their sweat management channels. It's not nearly as deep as you get in something like the Blackfin Pro, but you definitely, if you have the Blackfin Pro and you look in the inside of the temple, you'd be like, oh yeah, it's the same kind of design, which I think is pretty neat. Uh, so you have the, the Megal rubber grip material on the temple tips as well as in the nose. And it is also vented in the nose, which is really cool. So you have all that venting. You also have metal keeper slots. You also have an interchangeable rubber nose pad, which is really cool when you look at it and uh, don't let anyone tell you it can't be, because I was about to say it can't be, but it does have an interchangeable design on the nose pad, which which is very cool. Performance features like this make it a great choice if you're looking for something with versatility and performance in mind. This is also available, by the way, with Costa Authentic lenses. You can get it from Sporter X with Sporter X lenses, or you can get it from Costa with Costa Authentic lenses, which is very cool. Also available in two eye sizes, it's available in a 54 and a 57, which translates to an SFW of 132 millimeters and 137 millimeters respectively. 
Hey, if you're enjoying this content, but maybe you have additional questions about men's eyeglasses or prescription lenses, you can reach out to one of our very friendly supporter X opticians because they would love to hear from you. And for even more lists on best men's eyeglasses, we have videos and we have blogs. We'll put links in the description below. Next up, we have the Ray-Ban. I mean, we're talking best eyeglasses. I felt pressured. You can't do top eyeglasses without putting Ray-Ban in there, right? I mean, not that pressured. It's also a classic. It's not new by any stretch of the imagination, but it's never going away. This is gonna be a classic, really cool style, I think, forever. Unique frame in our lineup due to its mixed composition because you have metal and you have plastic, that kind of horn rim design. It is made out of acetate and metal. You do have adjustable nose pads here that are silicone. It's a little different design. That's something to be aware of with this frame with the nose pads. Uh, it's a little more of a vintagey design, which looks cool, but can be a little trickier when you're needing nose pad replacements because it doesn't fall along the same lines as either the press on or the screw on nose pads like you'd find in your typical nose pad replacement kit. You're gonna need to go to probably realistically an authentic Ray-Ban dealer to get this style of nose pad because I don't really see anyone else, not that many anyway, doing this style of nose pad. Something to be noted one of those styles that you really can't go wrong with. It's been around for decades and it's not going anywhere. Fully adjustable temples, really straightforward frame, solid frame. When it comes to sizing, it's available in two eye sizes. Again, 49 eye size and a 51 eye size, and that translates to an SFW of 133 millimeters and 137 millimeters respectively. And I will say with a 49 eye size and a 51 eye size, it's pretty surprising that they are as wide as they are. That's why that SFW is important. It gives you a little bigger, better picture, better understanding of how it's actually gonna fit practically. And next up, we have a Rain. This is a new addition to the Rain catalog. It's called the Kovac. I love Rain. They are, I think, kind of the epitome of that lifestyle and eyewear design. They're actually local as well, so that's probably why it's near and dear to my heart. They are in Oceanside, which is a Southern California, Northern San Diego city. Very cool style. I love them. This one is inspired by a vintage oversized frame designs. I think it's really cool because it's a little more of a squared lens. I think it's tough to find squared lenses, to be honest with you. Usually you're gonna find something that's more rectangular. The bridge design is a little bit more of a keyhole nose bridge, which gives you a little more versatility in bridge fit. Why it, what I mean is that it caters to a wider range of bridge sizes and shapes. They also went a little deeper in their nose piece, how far the, the nose piece protrudes from the frame, which also gives you a little more versatility in even flatter nose bridges. It's almost a little more like the universal or global fits that you will get as a, a secondary option from some brands, but it is designed to be more of an all around fit in this one frame here. Rain likes to work with acetate because it does beautiful jobs for colors and you will find that in all of their different colorways. And it is also very durable and nice and flexible, very easy to adjust, very easy to work with. Available with custom Sporter X lenses. And this comes in one eye size, which is a 50 eye size. And when it comes to SFWs, that lands you at 135 millimeters. Yet again, another good reason to pay attention to that SFW because 135 is more in that like medium, even medium to large-ish range. But a 50 eye size being alone by itself is more of a small fit. And so that is gonna fit more of a medium, even medium to large size. So keep that in mind. Next up, we have a Spy. This is the Spy Cyrus Optical. Spy is another local brand, which we love here in Southern California. And if that name Cyrus is familiar to you, it is because they took one of their classic beloved sunglass styles and they made an optical version. What I really like about their direction with this frame is that they didn't just take their Cyrus and shrink it down a little bit. They actually made a completely new frame that is just modeled after the Cyrus. So it really does capture that Cyrus essence without just being a ripoff of the Cyrus. So really cool, definitely a good kind of brother to anybody that wears the Cyrus as a sunglass. 
awesome style. Also amazing if glasses tend to be too small on you because this is by far the biggest frame in, my, in our lineup. And I'll get to that in just a moment. Very bold look, obviously, like I said, just inspired by the Cyrus, which is also very bold. They also went with a propionate material, which is uh, uncommon, actually. Spy is one of the few manufacturers out there using this more advanced material. They do have a core wire temple for extra durability and adjustability. It'll hold that adjustment much better and very much available with Sporter X custom lenses. When it comes to sizes, also available in two eye sizes and very large, like I mentioned, a 58 eye size and a 60 eye size. When that translates to an SFW of 145 millimeters and 149 millimeters, I think easily the largest frame in our catalog across the board. Next up, we have a Maui Gym. I love Maui Gym. I think they're doing amazing work in the eyeglass sector right now. Forever they've been sunglasses only, but more recently they've been doing a lot of really cool work with eyeglasses. And here we have the MJ02211. The only thing they're not doing a great job with is the naming conventions being easier to remember. So just, you gotta jot it down, I guess, if you're liking this style, really solid. Great straightforward frame, a little more square rectangular. So again, that thing, like I mentioned, it's easier to find rectangular lenses. This is a little more rectangular, but it does have kind of a square vibe. That sounds very weird as I hear it coming out of my mouth because it kind of doesn't make sense, but it makes sense to me. So here we are. This is an acetate frame material. It is a generous rectangular lens that works on just about every face shape on the planet. Very comfortable fit with a typical plastic saddle style nose bridge which is going to help to evenly distribute the weight across your whole bridge. They also went with a cool design detail. They do this mountain wire temple core, which on the inside, so you can see it's semi-transparent on the outside and the inside is more fully transparent. So you can see that wire core and that design detail. Just another nod to Maui Jim pulling out all the stops and really paying attention to every last detail. This is available with Maui Gym authentic lenses, including their sunglass lenses, which is really cool. Their whole optical collection is available in amazing clear lenses. I'm actually wearing a pair of Maui's right now where they do an amazing lineup of clear lenses, but also all of their sunglass lens, their whole sunglass lens catalog is available in their ophthalmic line as well, which is very cool. This is available in one eye size, which is a 55 eye size, and it lands you at an SFW of 140 millimeters. And last but not least, we have another Maui Gym. This is the MJ02723. We started with a titanium frame from Oakley, and we're going to close it out with a titanium frame from Maui Gym. Elegant, very minimalist style, but what I love about this is that it is really low profile, but pretty dang bold. It's, it's fun when they kind of mix those two elements together with something that it is really just in the shape. And it, it, you see it a little bit in some of the design. Uh, it's a little more vintage of a look. I think I would see this on, you know, a great grandfather's photos, wearing a nice round frame that is very low profile, really cool style. Again, 100% titanium all the way down to the temples. You do not have any grip in the temples, but you do have the silicone nose pads that are nice and soft and very grippy. Uh, this is also one of those nose pads that's a little bit different. It's not a screw in, it's not a press on, it's kind of a press on, but a little bit different. This is something that you would need to get replaced from an authentic Maui dealer. It is a smart style that you can rely on for years to come. A little more discreet, extremely lightweight. That is the first thing you'll notice when you pick it up. One thing to note, being that it's titanium, being that it's super thin, it might feel insubstantial. It might feel like it's gonna be weaker on the face or not be as durable, but because it's titanium, that is not a concern. Another thing that it's sharing with the number one frame on this table is that it is also an inline design. So again, they are doing that inline groove and the frame sits inside of that groove. So really cool, very minimalistic, but it does show the lens thickness a little more. What's cool is that it's a round style and a round lens shape will show thickness less because with most prescriptions, the lens gets thicker as you get away from the center of the lens. So a round lens means that you show less of that thickness. 
This is also available in only one eye size, which is a 49 eye size. And the SFW is 135 millimeters. Again, that's more of a medium, even a pretty solid medium fit, but a 49 eye size would make you think that it's gonna be a small fit. So keep an eye out for those SFWs, they help. That wraps it up for our top picks in men's eyeglasses for 2022. Again, we're excited to talk about this. So we started the year off right. And I hope you found some frames that are a new contender for a best pair for yourself. If you're liking any one of these, stick around for a moment longer. We'll have an easy to click shop now button. And again, if you're ready to order, don't forget about that Seabitter guarantee. I really think it gives you a ton of peace of mind. And for peak peace of mind, us opticians, we're here to help you. We our whole goal in life is just to make sure that you get something that works well for you and that you're happy with and we will do whatever it takes to make sure that that happens and so why not reach out to us because we love hearing from you thank you so much for watching i hope this is interesting or valuable information if so throw us a like because that helps us out you can find relevant videos over here if you're ready to shop any of these great styles which you should be you can click this button right here it'll take you straight to them if you're looking for more content to consume as we all are these days you can check us out on our apps we're just about every social media outlet out there and then we have good stuff i think you should check it out.